They yeah, use they the use COVID. young black hey, men. Girl, you were so young and nice. You don't even know who they is. They use young black men for a very, very long time. You better know who the fuck is. I'm saying, who are you talking about? The white man, girl. Sexy red don't got no power babysitting sexy red. Sexy red has influence. It's a it's a it's a what is that? Sexy red has influence. I've been fighting for years. You don't know who the fuck is. Oh, no, 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 when a black man was growing around sagging his pants, black women used to talk bad about him. To this day, black I women... I still do. Okay, can you just say keep it cutting? So, <laughs> when a black man does certain things, he gets ridiculed, and we all jump on the bandwagon, and we all are supposed to, right? They was using black men to destroy this race, right? Mm -hmm. Over and over and over. The rap music, they did it with everything, right? So, now that they can't target black men anymore like that because it's too public, they doing something else. So those that know what the fuck they doing, we supposed to stand up and say something and not give a flying fuck about what nobody else got to say. Because at the end of the day, y'all not standing up and saying nothing. I get it. It's music. Listen to it. Fine. That's not the point. Right. That's not the point. The point is what is the music being used for? What is the music doing? If we are ever, as a people... <coughs> Going to move forward and have anything in this world because my dreams and my glories ain't everybody's dreams and glories, but I got kids. So I got to think about 30, 40, 50, 60 years into the future. That's what I have to think about. So I got to get as many people because if I just position my children, that shit don't mean nothing. They're going to still struggle. So I got to try to position as many people that should be or could be around my children. See, the, see and I'm going to prove a point. See, the white folks did it. This is where the term blue blood came from. Your family married into your family and your cousin married into your cousin. And they kept their power. That's why they dominating shit now. I ain't with the blue blood concept. So I'm with the uplift all of my people. See, it ain't just sexy red alone. It's the rap niggas too. Once right. you get to know me, trust me, I beat niggas in their brain way worse than women. But what I'm saying is, y'all, our last line of defense. Like queen, right. And we playing chess. That's the strongest piece on the board. Once you lose your queen, the game is T fucking over. Over. Facts. You so, lose your so queen, you lost the game of chess, yeah. and I'm a chess yeah. man. Ain't too many people can beat me in chess. I got taught by taking the queen. You can't beat me in chess. I'll prove it right now. I got taught by taking the queen off the board. The nigga that taught me how to play chess told me, choose where you want me to checkmate you. That's how I got taught how to play chess. Right. You see what I'm saying? So when slavery was won, it was y'all. Do your research. Mm -hmm. yeah. It was y'all. So when we need to get out of the fucking hot pot, it's y'all. So... I'm going to forever say fuck sexy red. Yeah. Y'all don't like it? Y'all don't like it? Sexy red ain't going to be 